Hello again, everybody. Wayback Sports Cards, and you see right in front of you, 1991 Upper Deck Baseball Final Edition set. And we're going to unbox this today. I bought a series of tops, or traded, shouldn't say tops, but score, tops, Fleer, a bunch of traded rookie uh, sets. And this is one of them that I got, this 1991 Final Edition set of Upper Deck. It's a 100-card set. And um, instead of releasing like a high series set, um, Upper Deck created this distinct update style. And it's the only year Upper Deck would produce a final edition set and was packaged in the same type of box as uh, 1989 and 1990s high series from Upper Deck. Um, 100 cards in the set. This contains the only true rookie card of Pedro Martinez. And one of only two rookie cards of uh, Jim Tomei. And also has a Pudge Rodriguez rookie card. So um, just unboxed it. Stacked it right here. Um, there's also um, subsets in here. Diamond skills cards. Depicting the best minor league prospects. And all-star cards. And there's also uh, six hologram cards in here. There we go. So we're going to get right into this. Um, shouldn't take too long to get through these 100 cards. We've got a checklist for cards 1 through 50. We've got a card for Dennis Martinez, El Presidente, throwing the Perfecto, the perfect game in 1991. So this documented that game, and that was July 28th of 1991. So it's a cool card. Always like the Vernon Wells artwork. we got our holograms, the Yankees. The Phillies, Pirates, just trying to get the reflection. You can also see me a little bit. The Braves and the Reds. Looks like the Stay Puffed Marshmallow Man instead of the Red, but that's okay. We got Anthony Young, uh, rest in peace. Andy Ashby, Doug Simmons. Really clean design. That upper deck was known for at this time. So these are really good looking cards. Um, you can see the backs as well. I'll show one of them here for Brett Barbary. Um, might be his rookie card actually. Pretty two thirds photo on the back as well. And uh, stats and a um, little bit of a blurb as well. So pretty nice. Um, trying to avoid the glare here from my uh, from the room here. Ron Darling with the A's. Tim Burke, Dean Palmer, underrated player with the Rangers, Mark Bowlers, closer there for the Braves for a while, got the kid Ken Griffey Jr. and Ryan Sandberg, top two vote getters from the All-Star game, there you go, All-Star checklist, so now we're going to start getting into the All-Stars. Jack Morris, also winner of Game 7 of the 91 World Series with the Twins. And so I'm going to pick these up right here. We've got Sandy Alomar Jr., Big Daddy Cecil Fielder, Roberto Alomar, Wade Boggs, Cal Ripken Jr., who I believe won the Home Run Derby, Ricky Henderson, Bill Kruger. Oh, so we're back to regular cards here. It looks like uh, uh, Ryan Klesko and Reggie. Uh, where is that? Forgetting the last name here. Reggie Sanders. There you go. With the Reds. Kind of cool. This is the checklist for the prospects card right there. And you see, there you go. The one true rookie card of. Pedro Martinez, Royce Clayton, Dan Wilson, Dimitri Young, Ryan Klesko, Tom Goodwin, Rondell White, Reggie Sanders. People forget Klesko and Sanders had pretty good careers. I think Reggie Sanders, if I'm not mistaken, hit over 300 home runs for his career. Arthur Rhodes, longtime successful reliever. Gerald Williams, rest in peace. There you go. There's the Jim Tomei card. Robert Einhorn, 
Mark Newfield, Kerwin Moore, Jeff McNeely, Frankie Rodriguez. I think that's the end of that set. Andy Moda, Chris Haney. And then we're back to the All-Stars. Dave Henderson. We'll take the last batch right here. We've got Kenny Lofton with the Astros. Derek Bell. Dave Nilsson. Candy Maldonado. One of the best names in baseball. Steve Howe, another rest in peace there. Danny Nagel. Scott Coolball, interesting angle there on the photo. Darren Lewis getting some swings in before the game. Candelaria. Wilson Alvarez. Benzinger. Oh, a flip there. Thought it was a short print. <laughs> it's just Rick Wilkins. Ryan Bowen, Ed Sprague, who I think, yep, I was going to say later became third baseman, but he's catching here. Candiotti, the oil can with the Rangers. Don't remember him with the Rangers. Remember him with the Red Sox. That's the best part of these uh, traded series. You get to see some of these guys on teams you don't remember them with. There's Pudge rookie card. Roger McDowell, Otis Nixon, Juan Bell. Well, oh, that's interesting. Got to go back to that shattered bat photo. Danny Tartable from the 91 All-Star Game. Would become a Yankee in 92. Bobby Bonilla, still with the Pirates there. Became a Met the next season. Got Andre Dawson, the Hawk. Tony Gwynn. Yvonne Calderon. The wizard, Ozzy Smith, which looks like Benito Santiago behind him. Chris Sabo, the Rex Specs. Ryan Sandberg, Will Thrill, Benito Santiago. And our final card here, Tom Glavin. So there you have it. That is 100 cards from Upper Deck 1991 Final Edition. And we'll just take another quick look at the big card from this break the rookie card of pedro martinez with the high hat take a look at the back as well best right-handed pitcher at least that's what this subset thought of him and uh certainly lived up to it nice little blurb there five feet 11 inches and 150 pounds expected to throw harder than his brother ramon so interesting card right there let me get this in a top loader uh but there you have it a pretty good final edition set for 100 cards some pretty good cards in here the all-stars is a nice touch kind of gives some uh star power to the set so let me know what you think about this and um as always like comment subscribe and uh stay tuned I'll have more of these coming up and uh have a great day everyone so long